Hey, what is up, YouTube? Welcome to yet another video. Today, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make your internet faster with a couple of easy steps. So, um, the first most simple step is you want to go to your browser and just make sure you have no add-ons up here. Like if you have like a toolbar, for example, Bing toolbar or Ask toolbar, you want to remove those because they actually use up some of your internet bandwidth and will slow down your internet connection. So, after you've done that and you're your browser is clear of all those add-ons we're gonna get to our next step so our next step is that you want to uh, change your DNS servers um, I have a couple right here these are pretty uh, pretty well known um, you can also use other ones you can search the internet for uh, better ones for you if you want but um, uh, these are recommended by me um, so what you want to do is you want to find this little thing right here um, most Windows computers have it Windows 7, Windows 8 have it. If you're Ethernet, it will show up like this. If you're wireless, it will show your bars. You just want to right-click on that and do Open Network and Sharing uh, Center. Sorry about that. So, now you want to go to Ethernet or Local Area Connection or Wireless Area connect, uh, wireless area Connection, depending on what how you're connected. So, you just want to click on that. And then, it will open up this little pop-up. You want to go to Properties. It will open up another pop-up. And you want to scroll down here until you find internet protocol version 4 now you want to double click on internet protocol version 4 and it should open up another box and inside of here you want to go down here and if for you it should say obtain dns server address automatically you want to click on use the following dns server address and the dns servers are going to be in the description so for the preferred dns server it's 208.67 dot two 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 dot two 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 and the alternate server address is two oh eight two oh eight dot sixty seven dot two two zero dot two two zero so um that's uh, this uh the dns servers some people have said that if you take off the alternate dns server it, it might make your internet a little faster um you can try it if you want and see if it makes it faster but uh for me both of them work perfectly fine, so I'm just going to keep it as it is. Press OK, OK, and close. I'll close this. Now, what you want to do is you're going to want to find your computer. Uh, I have it right here on my desktop. You just right-click on it. You go to Properties. Um, if you don't have this on your desktop, you just want to open up a normal uh, file right here. And on your local disk, or sorry, uh, not on your local disk. On the side here, it should say This PC. You right-click on that. You go to Properties, and it should open up the same thing. So now what you want to do, you want to go to Device Manager. And then you want to find Ports, Com, and LPT. You want to open that up with a little arrow, uh, arrow on the side. Then you want to double click on Communication Port. And it should open up this. You want to go to Port Settings and Bits Per Second. Yours should be set at something around uh, 7200 or 9600 or something like that. Either way, what you want to do, you just want to change it the whole way to one, uh, 128,000 bits per second. And then you also want to go to flow control. For you, it's going to say none. You want to change it to hardware. And you press OK. And uh, that should uh, that should fix it. And if it doesn't fix it for you, or if, if it even slows down your internet connection, you just want to go back and just open it again. And then you can just do restore the default right here. And it'll, uh, it'll put everything back to the v default. So if I do that, you see 9,600 none. I'm just going to put it back as it was. Like so. There you go. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. And sometimes even if the internet is perfectly fine and you're trying to load a page but it just won't load. What you want to do is you want to press the Windows key plus R. You want to click CM uh, You want to type CMD. Press enter. It will open up this command prompt. And inside of it, you want uh, you want to type IP config, and then slash flush uh, space slash flush DNS. Press enter, and then you want to do end local. There you go. Now you just close that, and then you should just you just refresh the page, and it should work perfectly fine. Thank you for uh, watching the video, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, if you guys have any comments or questions. If something didn't work for you, let me know in the comment section below. I'll try to answer it. Um, yeah, guys, thank you for watching, and don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe.